coming to breakfast. <laughs> Jesus, that is that who I think it is? Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, it is! Oh, it is! Oh, it is! Remember me? <laughs> yeah, sure, Doris Day. <laughs> That's what I was going to say to you. Love what you've done with your hair. Oh, I ain't done nothing with my hair. I just wash it and dry it and roll it and brush it and comb it and sometimes tie it. Oh, <laughs> don't just jeez about dying hair. It makes anybody before. feel so old. Oh, oh. Take your coat. Oh, oh, look, ain't this a beautiful man? Gorgeous there, gorgeous Louise here. Well, it's nice to see you. Sit down, sit down oh, there. Thank you, Archie. Uh, not that I want to say anything, Louise, but you know, uh, a lot of people uh, nowadays, they think it's kind of un-American, you know, to walk around with a lot of dead live animals on your back. No, Archie, they grow them little minks on ranches, special for coats. <laughs> It, it don't make no difference whether you chase the animals around the ranch or you chase them through the streets of New York. Somebody has got to club the animal to death. Oh, no, they don't do that. Well, what the hell do you think they do? One zip them? <laughs> Come on, Louise, have a bear claw. Yeah, well, you know, speaking of animals puts me in mind of, uh... Well, your husband George, you know. <laughs> I mean, geez, we ain't seen much of him lately. Well, I guess he ain't got no time to go slumber nowadays, you know, at the five cleaning establishments. Seven. Oh, what did you seven? Here. <laughs> Listen, hey, I'm a businessman myself, Louise. You know, I bought Kelsey's saloon on there. But one of these days, if I get the time, I'd love to drop in on George. Well, if you can't come in person, just send your clothes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What well, brings you here, Louise? Mind if I ask you a question, huh? Mm -hmm. So, what brings you here, Louise? Well, our house is ready for renting. All but the drapes, which I'm going to pick up right now. And some people are coming to look at the house. Would you show it to them for me, Edith? Oh. Me? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. She could do that. You could no, do but that. I you ain't... could do that. But I ain't never showed a house before. It's easy to show it. Show it to people. Understand? You just take them in, you show them to all of the rooms, and you say, isn't this a, a positively doll's house? <laughs> Please, Edith. Yeah, oh, yeah. You're right. I'll yeah, try it. She'll do it. Yeah. Oh, my. I ain't been back next door since Mike and Gloria and Joey left. Oh, my, it's gonna be sad. I'll bet when I walk through the rooms, I'll hear voices. Uh, stay with us, Lord. <laughs> That's one of her old-time problems, Louise, you know? Sometimes she hears voices. What's wrong with that? Sometimes I hear voices, too. <laughs> Yeah, but you don't crawl into bed with me at night and tell me what the verses say. Thank goodness. Oh, I must run. Oh, could I take this with me for later? Oh, yeah, yeah. Right. would you like to take a nice, soft, speckled banana? No, thanks. <laughs> All the information you may need will be in this envelope. Right. And here are the keys. Oh, well, and I'll call back later. Yeah. Now, if anybody wants to rent the house, mm -hmm. just call George's secretary. Right. Oh, ho, oh, oh, secretary. But the man has seven stores. Don't he have seven secretaries? Only one. He may be rich, but he's still cheap. Oh, oh, oh goodbye. Oh, goodbye. Oh, See you. 